A stroke and traumatic brain injury are the most common insults to the brain. They affect a large proportion of patients. And patients that have had a stroke or a traumatic brain injury often have a visual field defect. When patients have a visual field defect, they will have difficulty uh, with mobility because they will bump into things. They will not be able to see obstacles. They will have a lot of difficulty reading, finding objects on a computer screen, watching TV. Um, this is a significant problem in rehabilitation. Up to now, we have a number of rehabilitation interventions for people with strokes or traumatic brain injury, such as physical therapy, speech therapy, occupational therapy. But visual therapy has really been neglected for many years. And it is this area where uh, Novo Vision and Vision Restoration Therapy plays a very important role. I think it has been neglected in the past because we did not have very effective interventions up to now. Vision restoration therapy has been developed for patients that have a visual field defect due to a neurologic injury. Most of the patients that have been treated have had strokes or traumatic brain injury. Vision restoration therapy is a neurorehabilitation intervention that is performed at home. It is delivered through a device that is programmed specifically for the visual field defect of that individual person. It is not generic therapy. The physician that evaluates the patient with a visual field defect will write a prescription. The patient will undergo a visual field test and that information will be very important to design the specific therapy for that particular type of visual field defect. The device loaded with a patient's therapy will be sent to the patient's home. The patient will do vision restoration therapy at home and then on a monthly basis the uh, therapy will be updated to accommodate for any improvements that may have occurred. Treatment is usually performed for about 30 minutes twice a day, six days a week. And the typical course of therapy is about six months. We have looked at a large series of patients and surprisingly we found that neither time from their event, from their stroke or traumatic brain injury, nor age played an important role in their ability to improve after vision restoration therapy. In fact, I have a number of very elderly patients who have had very good results with vision restoration therapy. I have treated a number of patients and I have found uh, that about 70% of my patients respond to this therapy. And those that do respond have an average improvement of about five degrees. That is, there is an expansion of about five degrees of the seeing field or shrinkage of five degrees of the blind field. And this translates into improved mobility, avoidance of obstacles, avoidance of collisions, improved reading.